The cultivation of the understanding, as of any of man's other faculties, is generally achieved by his own activity, his own ingenuity, or his own methods of using the discoveries of others. Noam Chomsky is and has been one of the smartest people in the room. He absolutely saw the big picture involving real events and their implications. People need to understand the level to which they are being manipulated by the forces around them and honestly they need to learn history to understand our long-term behavior as humans and why things are the way they are now. Noam Chomsky had a really solid grasp of that and he saw the forest for the trees really and um, a lot of what he says sort of peels that apart and explains how the world works and like what's really going on. I think people really need to pay attention to what he's saying while he's still here. I grew up in the 90s when it was in vogue to be political and informative with music and art and stuff like that. And uh, you know like Rage Against the Machine or George Carlin for two examples. So this is a great excuse for me to tell a story and use music to get some of my views across via musical storytelling and you know his views as well, Noam Chomsky's views. I felt that music's a very powerful vehicle for getting ideas across because, you know, when when people are listening to music, you really have their full attention and they're in it. I mean, music's very powerful for human nervous systems and people in general. They kind of self-tribalize and form groups based on genres or favorite bands and stuff like that. So, I mean, you're really you're really touching people's souls and minds when you're making music. So, I, I feel like it's a really effective way to sort of communicate things. The cultivation of the understanding as of any of man's other faculties is generally achieved by his own activity, his own ingenuity.